I've spent $40,000 every month for the last couple of years producing social media content to grow my businesses. Now, I know most of you guys are never gonna spend anything close to that. And the cool thing is, you're never gonna have to because we are completely changing the game for entrepreneurs and investors on how they can have a one-stop shop for creating social media content and building a personal brand. And it's gonna cost way less than $40,000 and that's why I'm so excited about it. So behind me, we are currently renovating my downstairs office to become a full-on media company for entrepreneurs. And I wanna show you guys behind the scenes of what we're doing and what the business is gonna look like. So let's go check it out. So I've done other office tours in the past where I showed you our upstairs office as well as this downstairs one. And before, we had a bunch of cubicles and tables and everything else because a lot of our staff was working out here. But I got inspired after watching a bunch of different online events and I said, you know what? Instead of making this just all staff, this would be an amazing spot for events. Now, we had held events before here where we fit over 100 people, but it was kind of bootleg because we still had the tables here and there was no stage or any of these other things. Like it was just really an office that was converted into an event space. Well, I said, you know what? What if we just made an event space full time? And on top of that, what if we made some of these other offices, other media spaces, not only for us and the content and businesses we own, but for other people as well. And after really thinking about it and looking at the potential numbers, we decided to do just that. So let me explain to you what we're doing with the office and I'll tell you what it looks like business-wise and how we plan to monetize. So first thing we did was we cleared out everything and we said, okay, this is going to be an in-person and virtual workshop. We are gonna build a stage. We've got an LED screen coming. The LED screen alone cost me about $40,000 because we have to get the highest quality screen so that it shows really well on camera. You can get cheaper ones that a lot of churches and other venues use where people are far away because you can't really see the pixels too in depth. But because we're gonna be filming a lot of virtual events, it needs to be the highest tier. So the LED screen alone, 40 grand. We got this stage custom built um, with the shape we wanted. We're also going to be getting a cool cover on it that says wealthy, and we'll be able to actually change the cover for people who wanna use this space as well. And then we have enough room on both sides of the stage to put just cool little art pieces. Um, we could also put the vibe board that you guys see me do content on. So we're also, as you can tell from the ceilings, building out all the electrical. We've already got our speaker system hooked up. We've got the stage lights getting ready. We're gonna have cameras and everything else just mounted so that it's a full on spot that the moment we have an event, boom, you just turn it on and it's perfect. Because we're still gonna be working out of the private offices on a day-to-day -day basis, we wanna cover those up when people do wanna use an event. So we have covers all the way across and it's gonna kinda give it like that movie theater feel. So that's gonna be super cool. Plus, we have the ability to use either tables or no tables, just depending on how many people are coming to the event. If we have full on tables, you're gonna have less seating, so we could probably fit like 75 people in here. If we wanted to do only chairs, we could probably fit 125 people. So I'm really excited about this because we'll have the technology to be able to put on an amazing live event, but also hold an amazing virtual event as well simultaneously, not only for myself, but for other entrepreneurs who wanna rent this space from us. As somebody who's thrown massive events, I know how costly it is to do so. Our last event, we spent over $400,000 just to throw it here in Las Vegas. And there are really no event spaces like this that can fit about 100 people where everything is just perfect and ready to go. It can be live streamed. It can be an amazing in-person experience. And I'm really excited for what the future holds for this space, not only for my company, but for those who rent it. Now, as we come over here, you'll realize that you're gonna have the curtains going all the way across. And so this is gonna kind of be the green room, right? You've got a couch over here. We're gonna put a TV so that people in the green room can see what's happening on stage and everything else. Then we've got a couple of private offices. But what's really cool is we're also building new studio sets beyond just the workshop area. And this is gonna be the first of many. So in here, we are gonna have three different podcast sets. So you can see we're already building out these picture frames on the wall. It's gonna look really good. This is going to be a completely different set right here. And then we'll have a whole nother set right here. 
Now, you would never know this when it's on camera. You'd think these are all three completely different spaces when it's gonna be all said and done, but we'll be able to house three different sets right here with the cameras, the lighting, everything else, so that our clients can get different looks and feels for all the content we're producing for them. And then right next door to it is my studio, where we've already rented this out to many of our clients, and they've used this beautiful white wall. I've even let some of them use my kind of Vegas theme set. But you know, over here, we're upgrading everything as well. We're doing so much with the live stream side of things. We've got all of these wires being integrated right now. Um, we've got different kind of cameras and sliders. We're really stepping our game up production value wise, but also being able to offer it to everyone else. So you might be asking yourself, how's all this gonna work? Why are you doing it? What's it gonna look like? So first off, let me say there are two main reasons why we're doing all this. The first is that we're gonna use it no matter what for my businesses. We plan to have events in that workshop space every single month. I plan to use those different sets in my content so that we can have just different looks and it's not always the same. So either way, even if we never allowed anyone else to use it, it would still be a great move for my business. But the second reason we're doing it is because I've heard so much demand for people wanting something like this. If you didn't know, I have an education company called Wealthy Creator, which is geared towards helping entrepreneurs grow on social media. And we teach them all the tricks in the trade of building a brand on social media. We show them how to make videos, create hooks, titles, thumbnails, how to monetize, create funnels, and all of those things that are needed to do really well on social media as an entrepreneur. But we never did any of those services for them. We always said, hey, here's how you can find an editor. Here's how you can find a producer. Here's where you can go find and build a studio. And I just realized after six months that people would rather have us do it. And I realized it's actually a really lucrative business if we do it right. And so instead of ignoring the demand, I said, you know what? Let's just build a company that is solely focused on doing media for entrepreneurs. And that's how this new endeavor, Pineda Media, was born. You can go check us out at PinedaMedia.com where you can go apply for a call with our team and see if it's a good fit for us to handle your social media needs. So we're gonna have a bunch of different services for entrepreneurs to use. The first is short form content, meaning TikToks, Reels, or YouTube Shorts. In our basic package, you'll be able to send us raw footage and our team will edit them and send it back to you looking great, just like mine but if you want to get more in-depth service you can go up to tier two where my team will actually help you come up with ideas for your videos and be with you on a call while you film so that they can coach you up through the call make you say things the right way help you reword things so that they can go viral and make the filming process for you so much easier this is how i've been able to put out so much content over the years i just show up to the filming session and my team already has everything ready for me, and they just pepper me with questions which I answer based on my own experience. And so our job in this tier is to help pull out the things you already know and help that become the best kind of content. And on top of that, we will post everything across all the social media platforms for you. So we'll not only coach you through creating the content, but we're gonna edit it and post it across TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube. It is a true done-for-you service on the social media side. But if you wanna take it up even another level, Level to our highest tier, you can get that, plus you can work directly with my production team where they're gonna coach you on a one-on-one -on -one basis outside of filming. This would be a deep dive into your brand every two weeks and just helping you become the authority that you're trying to be on social media. And we've already got lots of clients in all those tiers without me even talking about this business because we already had so many students and wealthy creator who have hopped on it so quickly. And as we go along, we're gonna have other add-ons like editing YouTube videos, creating websites and landing pages, and just being the one-stop shop for entrepreneurs. So I'm really excited about all the different products, and I can tell you just my impressions of the business are that I'm really passionate about it. I've always been passionate about creating social media content, and I'm always yelling at entrepreneurs that they need to do the same, because I know what it's done for my life, I know what me getting out there and speaking about the things I know has done for other people, and I know that if you're watching this and you're an entrepreneur or a business person, you have a lot to share with the world that can change your family's life and others who view your content. So being able to help people like you get your message out there is something that's really cool for me. But as a business, I also think that it's a huge opportunity to create a recurring revenue business. I've said it on previous videos that I spend about $40,000 a month just creating social media content. All of these people I've been paying for these years 
have been on a monthly recurring basis because I need all these videos edited, I need my people on staff, it's just something that doesn't stop. It's recurring and it's very sticky. And from my perspective, I already know there's lots of entrepreneurs who are willing to commit towards growing their social media. They're definitely not at the level of spending 40,000 a month, but they will spend 5,000 a month because that 5,000 a month towards their personal brand is far better than go spending $5,000 a month on cold calls or Zillow leads or whatever else you're currently doing for marketing. You see, at the end of the day, what you have to realize is that with social media, it's all just marketing. But the only difference is it's the kind of marketing that stays with you for the long haul and produces organic traffic. If I go spend money on a cold call, that's not bringing me in anything organically. I'm not building anything for the long haul. I'm just getting a deal or a client if I'm lucky. The same is true when you run a Facebook ad or when you get a Zillow lead or whatever the case is. It's a one-time thing. The moment you stop paying, it's dead. But when you start building a personal brand on social media, that content lives on social media forever and it can bring you leads day in and day out. And it only gets better and better over time. When I started spending $40,000 a month, I wasn't making the money I'm making today. But my income has exponentially increased because I've stayed consistent with spending the money. And so I know that as entrepreneurs start to use our service, they are gonna become very sticky because they're gonna start seeing the results in their business and it's gonna be a vital part of their marketing. And just to give you raw numbers of how I see this, if you add 200 entrepreneurs paying $5,000 a month, that becomes a million dollars a month in recurring revenue. And as somebody who already has hundreds of students and wealthy creator, getting to 200 people a month isn't gonna be that difficult. That education business is gonna continue to grow and it's gonna funnel people into this media business. And the media business on its own will attract clients who weren't in the education and in turn, they'll probably end up in education as well. So it's a great business to go along with the education. It actually reminds me a lot of my company TrueBooks, which I just started three years ago as a service-based company for our real estate investing community. And now it's a multi-million dollar company that could potentially become an eight-figure company here in the coming years. And the best thing about TrueBooks is the customers are very sticky. If we do a great job with their tax work, they're gonna continue to use us year in and year out. Pineda Media is basically the same thing, but on just a more monthly basis. So I think it has a lot of potential to create an eight-figure recurring revenue business. And that doesn't even factor all the other great things that are gonna happen from just having this business. The first is that other high-level entrepreneurs and investors are gonna hire us to do their content. And that's gonna lead to a ton of opportunities to do deals with these people, to do businesses with them, the list goes on and on. The more business you do with high level people, the more opportunities that come your way. And just overall, I think we have so many things that nobody else has to offer and it's a completely blue ocean for us. Being in Las Vegas where people are willing to travel, having the credibility I have with creating social media content, having all of these different spaces with the workshop, the different podcast sets, and having our expertise, I just think that it's a really good business and a huge opportunity that's just been sitting there for the taking. So if you're an entrepreneur and you're interested in us helping you create your personal brand and doing your content for you, you can go apply for our services at PinedaMedia.com. Also, if you wanna see how all of this turns out when it's completed and you wanna see some updates on the business as a whole, definitely hit the subscribe button and let me know down in the comments, what are you doing with your personal brand right now? Are you deciding to make content? What's your goals for 2023 and beyond? If I can help you out in any way, I would love to. So thanks for watching this video.